Two at noon with school starting Thursday for New York City students. Mayor Adams and the school's chancellor today unveiled a new plan to keep kids safe. It is a 14 point program to stop the dangerous practice of subway surfing. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Carlo joins us live from Long Island City with the story, which has been popular, the popular location for teens subway surfing many times in the hours right after school. Anthony. Maybe you never look better. I don't know about that. Maybe my voice can reach other young people who are doing these dangerous acts. This new public safety campaign developed by students for students discourages the dangerous social media trend of subway surfing. You can't just put a group of adults in the room and think you're going to figure out how to solve for problems that young people themselves are going through. The city turning to the youth for answers after five teens lost their lives subway surfing this year. The PSA, Subway Surfing Kills, Ride Alive, Stay Inside, will play in all 472 stations across the city. Officials making the announcement today from the 33rd Street, Rawson Street station, where 14-year-old Javon Frazier fell to his death on the tracks back in June. We have to be clear on this. These are our children. And we need to protect them in any way possible. Mayor Adams blasted social media platforms months ago for not restricting subway surfing content enough. Officials now saying tech companies are bearing down. We are working with the tech companies, Google, Meta, Snapchat, TikTok, and others, not only to get videos and photos of the reckless and risky behavior off of social media, but also to share content that affirmatively discourages this kind of behavior. The subway squad made up of New York City students spent their summer building graphics and animations for the new campaign. A loud wake up call from those who know best. Listen, listen, listen. It is something that I think we as youth can understand and kind of be able to better relate and empathize with. And the city says since working with tech companies to remove videos, they've taken down 2,600 videos showing subway surfing, but they want videos just like the one you saw that Milana there worked on. They want those shared on social media as much as possible.